Sparks flew in the early morning hours as crews were to prepare a water tower for demolition. The demolition process, known as tipping, is one of the most economical ways to take down tanks like this. The water pipe, supporting structures, and all connections were cut. Sections of steel were removed from one side to help weaken it and control the direction the tower would fall. Enough steel was left in place to help support the tower until it was time for it to go. The 178-foot-high structure in Legacy Business Park was built in 1985. It used to hold up to 2 million gallons of water. The tower hasn't been used in the last five years because it couldn't sully water during peak demands and fill during low demands, so it always remained full. Now, the tower must be taken down to make room for the new Legacy West development along the Dallas North Tollway. This 240-acre mixed-use project will include a high-rise hotel, a high-end shopping center with restaurants, and 621 apartment homes. It will also house Liberty Mutual Insurance's new 900,000-square-foot high-rise office complex. Just before 9 a.m., the final cuts were made, and the tower came down. Now that the tower is on the ground, crews will spend several days cutting it up for scrap. Soon, there won't be any traces of it left as portions of Legacy West begin to rise where it once stood.